Hi there, it's Amanda here from Lolly Lulu Crafts and today I have a video for you where I'm going to be showing you a haul that I got from Crate and Craft of the Tom and Jerry collection. I got recently the Muppets one and that was more die based. This is more paper craft kind of die toppers etc based. But I don't really normally go in for this as I said with the Muppets but I think some of these classics like um, the Muppets and Tom and Jerry kind of really just uh, was like I couldn't resist so I thought I would share it with you. Now I've got here one big sort of collection that came as a whole collection and then I've got some little extra bits as well so I'll let you know which bits come separately and also what I will do is put all of the links to the products on my blog post so as always if you're on YouTube just go to the paragraph below the video it says show more click on that and then the whole paragraph will open up and under that you'll see a link to the corresponding blog post click on that and it will go over to the website and you'll have all the links to the products and normally if it was a card the same thing applies but normally with a card obviously I'd have lots of pictures as well so it's always worth going over there and of course if you sign up on my website you always get notified when there's a new post or uh, well post means video as well for me because all posts are video posts so you would always get a notification of that. So first of all I've got the main collection that um, I don't know how they called it I think it might have been a paper craft or something like that and in this you get um, quite a few different bits and so I'm going to go through those with you quickly and we've got first of all um, a pack of 50 pieces by pieces they don't mean these individual elements either I think they literally mean sheets so there's 50 sheets 10 designs so you've got five sheets of each design clearly um, of die cut decoupage so if you can see here you've got your main image and then you've got um, not that one, that, those layers and the good thing is this is really good for um, start at new crafters as well I mean obviously there's a lot going on and if you're an experienced crafter I mean definitely from my point of view there's still loads that you can do but if you're new it's quite good because you can literally use it absolutely sort of plain as it is and create a really gorgeous card and the decoupage is all numbered for you so it says 1a so you know it's image one so you're not going to accident because there's two images on each sheet so you know which element belongs to which image and then it says a b c d etc so you know how to layer it and what order to layer it the first one is this one with this gorgeous little tom and jerry in his car so it's to say you get five of these so that's that and then we've got this beautiful I just love also the kind of vintage feel to the the actual card colors and this one is coated on this um, you can see the shine on it so you've got coated cardstock here look at him he's so cute and then there's Tom so there we've got so cute adore it <laughs> And then the next one. So you can see here you've got your main image. It looks very cartoon, comic-like. And then you've got your... So you've got what 2A here. Then you've got the next layer would be 2B. 2B as well. So now you might think, oh, why is there two the same number is that confusing well it's because they're on the same level so you would they're not going on top of another level so they've named it the same so that's why it's like that but so you can see how it's nice and simple for you if you're new but I know that you experienced crafters out there can go oh my goodness I could do this I could do that I certainly did when I saw it, it was just gorgeous. But actually sometimes, I don't know about you guys who are experienced crafters, but sometimes I actually just like doing a simple card, almost like the collection kind of indicates to do. It's just nice just putting it together and doing it nice and simple and classic. So, you know, you've got these options here. Oh, I just adore this. Look, I've got an extra one there. Look at that, we had that on his head. <laughs> My lighting's going a bit, I'm sorry, a bit, um, I don't know what's going on with the charges of the, uh, I've got like uh, battery packs on them and they're just sort of um, deciding to wear out all of them at the same time and 
for some reason they didn't charge even though I thought I put them on so obviously didn't click it in properly into the charger so but hopefully you can see enough anyway it's not that dark <laughs> when it gets pitch black we know <laughs> we know we've got to stop I just think that's so cute look at his little cheeks and then the final designs so it's 10 sheets five of each sheet but in each sheet you're getting two so you're actually getting 20 different card design or top of designs on this so you've got loads and loads and then obviously for each one you've got five so you're ending up with a hundred even if you just did this absolutely strictly you put the decoupage together for each sheet um, all of them absolutely you would end up with a hundred cards even if you just stuck it on the front of the card so I mean that is really good value okay so this is the paper pack for this you get um, 60 sheets and there are 10 designs so clearly uh, six sheets of each this is not coated paper so this is where if you're more experienced you've got the opportunity to do all your techniques and your stamping and all of that if you want to on here um, so you've got all that options but obviously if you're not your newbie you can just use it as is said it's a decent weight it, it, it feels like a sort of 180 220 something like that um, anyway that's your first design and then you've got gorgeous stars oh, look at that really fun and then we've got this is rather fun you could actually color all these in if you wanted and use it I said that that would be kind of cool then we've got some more stars different colors some heads of Tom and Jerry with some lovely stripes in the background and then we've got more stars different colorway again and then and different um, like hollow but this is white lines instead of the black lines that's kind of fun it's slightly different blue actually I think when you look at it next to each other then we've got this fun one again but with a yellow background instead of the um, red now also to note that these are all the exact colors that are used in the cartoons they got the, the Pantone numbers and obviously Disney is uh, sorry Warner Brothers is part of this so they're giving all that information so it is exact the colours in the cartoons and the comic books etc which is really cool so then the last one is um, another one of those sort of ones you could colour in and this is yellow with black lines so that is our paper okay so this is our die cut toppers pack you have 32 sheets and eight designs of each uh, yeah eight designs so eight sheets basically so as uh, eight designs of each sheet is a design is what I'm trying to say and then basically on here this isn't decoupage this is just like toppers so you can just use these as they are um, however you want to but they are just you're not decoupaging them up which is kind of fun so you, on this you've got like six on here so you're going to have different numbers so you've got one two four so then we've got four designs on this one four on here and they're just really fun colorful I, I, you think initially you might think oh they'd make great kids cards but I actually think that these would work really well for anybody because they are part of most of our childhood aren't they really so I think there's that nostalgic feel that could really work for any age I used I made that Muppet card that I made and showed you the video of um, a couple of times back now and that was actually my dad's birthday card so you know he's a older gentleman and he loved it. it it brought back memories of him when we when I was a kid that we used to sit and watch the Muppets you know it was kind of fun so it, it does work I think for the same kind of thing works here and you've got a couple of sentiments on here but look at this one you've got one two three four five six seven eight things if you include the sentence and now we've got die cut greetings um I think this one was separate 
I have a feeling this wasn't part of the original pack. Um, you will see if you go to the blog because as I said I'll put this up but I'm pretty sure I, I was I feel like this wasn't part of it but so far all of that's been part of the main pack and there's still a couple of other items that were part of the main collection but as I say I'll put it all on the blog post so you can see this also has 32 sheets but it's got four designs so you have got eight sheets of each which is really good because you've got loads on here as well we've got one two three four five six seven so you've got 14 on this one as well if you look you've got this great each one has got either tom or jerry or both and you've got lots of different types of sentiment here you've got birthday congrats best wishes thanks so loads and loads on there uh yeah that's the next one so this is rather fun these are like little tags which is good and you've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven on here so then the next one one two three four five six seven so 14 on here so you're getting loads of sentiments absolute tons on here and then the final set of eight and again loads look at that <laughs> it's just really nice because it really is in keeping with it and everything so i think that's really cool so that's the sentiments and then in the pack you also the original collection the main collection you get 40 envelopes and you get all the different colors that, that are complementary to the um collection and the, the you know the die cut elements and the papers and all of that so that's really cool and then you also get which is why I said it's also really good for beginners because you get everything from the envelopes and everything but you also get the card bases which is really fun but as also as an experienced crafter I really like this idea I always love card bases that match with any collection because I just think it looks so cool so you're getting 40 A6 cards here which for you American peeps out there is about five and a half by four and a bit it's a funny size because obviously you guys are kind of unusual most of people deal with a4 a5 a6 etc but you guys have a size to yourselves so that's why i thought it's roughly that size for you so you've got this great and it's a really nice weight as well because you know guys how fussy i am about my card base weight i hate anything that's too flimsy so that is really good so as i said you're getting four designs and 40 cards so you've got 10 of each obviously even i can do that one and so that's the next one so these are complementary to the papers as well so they match so you could layer up in any way you like there and this is obviously you can see it's coated unlike the papers but and then you've got that one and then the final design is that one there so that's your card bases which i absolutely adore but what I did also buy as a separate thing was some ribbons. This was the ribbon pack. Um, I know I've got loads of ribbons. You guys, if you've watched my lodge video, know I've got like all those in the uh, little drawers from Totally Tiffany. And I've also got those little suitcases that I put all my sort of loose ribbons in. But I just thought this is just too adorable. Look, you have got ribbons here that match it's got little toms and jerrys on them look at that these are bows so you've got a whole pack of bows here this has 60 bows in it so it's just look at that just too cute and then you've got the plain ribbons that are going to be the right colors and then you've got this and sorry that has uh two meters at one centimeters each so you've got three that are two meters by one centimeter wide and then this one is they're four meters long each one and you've got one two three four five six different types and they're all one centimeter as well so you can see how this is matching the little bows look at that with the present and jerry holding it tom i mean and then the so i just think that just adds that little extra something special to a card 
and I just think and I love the little bows actually that it comes with that I, I mean I can tie a bow but it's always nice when it's done for you especially because usually these pre-tied ones they've done it so that the pattern with pattern ribbons that can be a bit more fiddly to make sure the pattern is always on the outside of both sides of the bow and everything so that's all kind of sorted for you and then the last thing that I ordered that definitely was separate was the dies um it's not like the um Muppets one where you could have the paper pad that had the images on and you would cut the dies with the printed image it doesn't have that they're just plain simple dies if you could call these plain and simple so this is a pack of three it comes as that full set so you've got here it doesn't actually put um, on here a picture of it which is a shame I always like it when they have the picture so you've got uh, two little types of Jerry there look at him laughing his chops off bless him um, and then you've got Tom with the present that's the same as the one on that uh, ribbon so you've got images that complement each other which is really cool and then again you've got another large Tom and two little Jerry's now obviously they are the correct size to each other because obviously Jerry is a lot smaller than Tom um, and there he is being sick as <laughs> Think it's a parrot or pulling a face and there he is puffing his cheeks up if he's eating so much cheese and there's Tom emptying his pockets of his own body <laughs> I always used to think that was hilarious when I was a kid that he pulled his sides out um, and there he is pulling a face or doing I'm not sure what he's doing there I can't quite see and there's little Jerry and there's Jerry in his little car so that is those three and I just thought they were a bit extra to have those obviously dies aren't cheap but I actually just thought the paper kit will obviously at some point run out but I think this with the paper kit and actually forever you can make some really nice cards with it um and these will last you your lifetime won't they dies are just incredible so it's something that I felt was worth the investment and they weren't like ridiculous that you know sometimes dice can be like stupid money but these were okay considering they were you know a licensed brand as well so that is it that is the last item in this uh haul video for you but I just thought I would share it with you because it's just super cute and I thought that you would enjoy having a look at it and as I said I'll definitely put the links up for you for all of these items so that you can go ahead and don't forget if you're in the US the links to Create and Craft work for you as well um, because you can purchase from Create and Craft so they should work no problem um, but if nothing else it, and if you're not in the UK or the US and therefore you can't purchase from Create and Craft you can at least then see where what these items are and their precise names etc and maybe take a hunt for them i'm not sure when they'll become available to the general market if at all but a lot i think a lot of people can purchase now anyway i hope you have enjoyed taking a look at all these gorgeous items and i would love as always to hear your comments and what you think if you've already had this yourself or have you used it have you made some great cards let me know what you think of it and you know i'd love to know on facebook if you've paced post uh, but the, i would love if you've made some cards if you already have this collection um for you to post some pictures of them on my facebook page again the links for all of that are on my blog post um so do go over there and find me that way and i would love to see you guys on facebook twitter or instagram anyway all right thank you so much for watching and i will see you again soon bye for now bye <laughs>